I'm Bianca Lee, and I'm the founder and chief strategist at White Rose Marketing. I help my clients find their customers and communicate their service offerings and product offerings to their customers in a way that helps them grow their business. I offer strategic marketing services, so it's less of a product and more of a service. So I help people or I help my clients think through who is their target customer, where can they reach them, how much should they be charging them for their services, and how to properly communicate to them so that their product or service can be seen as relevant to them. Well, I, I do what I am. I mean, I studied marketing in school and I've spent a decade uh, of my life uh, working in marketing in corporate America, all over the world, which is what's great now. I've started my own marketing consulting firm where I get to choose the product pro projects and the clients that I work on. And um, yeah, I'm a self-proclaimed anthropologist. So I just love to learn more about how consumers behave, how companies behave, and I'm leveraging that passion to drive my company forward. Absolutely, I do. Interestingly enough, my story has to do with the broadening of my scope of, of my company. Um, so, like I was mentioning before, when I started my company, it was focused on one thing and I broadened it to uh, focus, you know, on just general marketing. And here recently, um, I've learned a little bit more about uh, working with the government. So, the federal government, state government, city government, local government, they all have budgets that they have to spend. Um, and they buy everything. And I, who, who would ever think of a government purchasing marketing services? It, to me, it just, it, it didn't compute. I think of governments buying infrastructure and, you know, snow and things, you know, trash removal, these, these types of things, but not marketing services. So I, I took a few uh, workshops and asked a few questions and networked with a few people that kind of were in the space. And, um, yeah, I started looking around and seeing that most of the most of the things that they were asking for, they they weren't they were sort of marketing like, but not really in my space. And so, you know, I say, you know what, this is this is just not for me. Let me just go back to getting my private clients. And you know, but um, in one instance, I actually applied for something that you know wasn't exactly marketing, but it was a pretty sizable contract. Again, um, it was something that I can do. Uh, professionally or my company can offer even though it's not in the center of our target capabilities and would you know that I was actually the only person that bid on this contract <laughs> so um, you know if, if I had gotten if, if I had let myself talk myself out of it not only would I have missed the opportunity to get started on what is going to be a journey of me understanding how to work with the government how to um, you know just the, the ways of working with them but it would also meant that this government agency would have had to extend the RFP, reissue, et cetera. And so because I got out of my head and, you know, did something that was a little bit out of the ordinary for me, something I had never done before, didn't really know a lot about, um, I actually opened up a new, almost like a, a new line of business for my company, a, a new potential space for me to, to, uh, to work in. And that, yeah, that that's going to sustain my business uh, for for quite some time. The the contract that I was able to secure, so yeah, you just you never know where opportunities are going to come from, and it's best to um, go for it. And if it happens, then that's great. But if it doesn't happen, then you at least learn something. What what I learned out of this story is that you're never going to get it if you don't go for it. Going for it doesn't mean that you're going to get it. But you definitely won't get it if you don't go for it. So from here on out, I'm going for it. <laughs> Everything I'm going for. <laughs> so yeah. I'm Bianca Lee and I will survive. <laughs>